Buddy, this is Beetle 5 starting the beat with Super Smash Brothers Brawl. Now, I know what you're thinking. Well, I'm not just gonna play some fights in Smash Brothers Brawl. What I'm gonna do instead is the adventure mode, the subspace emissary, which honestly is the coolest thing to ever come out of Super Smash Brothers. Because it's bit if you haven't played Brawl before, Super Smash Bros. Brawl really isn't as good now in comparison to the Wii U one, which I have, because I play Super Smash Bros. Wii U competitively now at local tournaments. So I'm incredibly skilled at this game. I've been playing it forever. I love Super Smash Bros. It's so much fun. I love all of them. Even Melee, as nuts as it is. I don't like competitive Melee, because if, if you know Melee, its mechanics are so nuts. They're, they're, it's crazy. I'm not even going to go into it, but... Brawl produced the coolest thing that could ever be in Smash Brothers, which is its own, like, cinematic storyline with all the characters mixed into it and, like, a story with feels and everything, and it's so cool. And it's so disappointing that Masahiro Sakurai did not make this kind of thing for the Wii U version. I don't know why he didn't. It would have turned out even more amazing with all the third-party characters that they got. Mega Man and Pac-Man and Cloud and Bayonetta. It would have been so so cool but regardless this is always really 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 awesome to play because i used to watch it like a cinematic movie because when you beat it you unlock all the cutscenes in it as a, and i used to watch it with my friends as a movie because it was so awesome but i'm gonna go ahead and play it right here and now i'll go ahead and make myself a name because i have a special control scheme i don't like having tap jump on i'm probably not gonna be used to these mechanics either so uh, let's go ahead and do it on normal mode should be fine all right here we go Mid-air stadium. The legendary Super Smash Brothers tournament shall now commence of the fighting. Zelda and Peach. Me and my friends, we always need to we, we play this again because the two-player also. We would do it so epic, like we would say them like Mario! Every time they introduce new characters and shit, because we always thought it was so cool. I love how they do freeze frames with that. Kirby. I love Kirby. Kirby's easily my favorite Nintendo character, but because I want to stick with the classics, I am going to be uh, Mario here and just fight on Kirby here, just to stick it to the norm. All right, Kirby, you're going down. Let's kick your ass. Boom, boom, oh, get a little game of game lag. That's okay. This is, I had to get this game through a uh, through BitTorrent, but it's the first time I've ever done a BitTorrent before because for some reason, it's emulating Wii games is not like emulating GameCube games and, and PlayStation 2 games and N64 games. Boom, you got spiked. You're done. <laughs> I still got it. It's a bit slower than uh than Wii U. It's not as fast. I'm used to it going a lot quicker. It's a little slow. Yo, ho pit. Your games are really cool now. I love Uprising. Uprising is such a great game. Look at that. We watch Smash Brothers like a competitive sport. It is alright, Kirby. It's, it's so cool because in here, when you lose or like die, per se, in a fight, you, you turn back into your trophy. Because this whole world is just reminiscent of and all the characters be trophies because the whole purpose of Smash Bros. is that the kid, the player, being the master hand, is is the child's hand. He's playing around with his toys because in Smash 64 they were originally toys, like dolls, but then they converted them to trophies instead, which is still cool because they revert back to their trophy forms when they're defeated. So that's a really awesome concept. And I always thought these guys looked like Heartless from Kingdom Hearts. The Primids. <laughs> There comes Zelda and Peach. Zoom. Ferora's wind. And she just pumps in her umbrella. Alright, I'm still gonna stick with the, with the Mario here. Little Kirby. And then Zelda. I don't like Peach. Just Pe I've never really been a fan of Peach. Besides, even when I'm playing this Zelda, I'd much rather be Sheik. Because Sheik is always stupid strong. These guys die in second. They are not strong. Oh, a smart bomb! Kabooey! You are dead. You are dead! Not big surprise, Kaboosh! Oh, I'm totally missing this giant thundercloud. Bonk, bonk, bonk. Wow, I just raised hell. And I've got to. Oh my god, that was so cool. I comboed those guys into each other. I am doing amazing. I'm not gonna take a hit. Oh, I took a hit. Damn you. Messing me up. Bonk. Goodbye. I <laughs> just throw you into oblivion. <laughs> Yeah. Phew, phew. 
Super Buddy Mario. Yo, this guy is the coolest. The ancient minister. Dropping off the legendary subspace bombs. Activated by ROBS, Robotic Operating Buddies, which are back then NES accessories. <laughs> I never understood how the hell he made it into this game. I guess it's just like a Japan favorite, because I, I doubt many people in America had a ROB accessory. I don't know. I, I never had an NES, so I, can't, I don't really know much about it. Oh, well, let's stop that bomb. Ooh. Ooh, well, shit. Bye, Mario. A Kirby! Oh no! Peach and Zelda! Yo, look at you! I haven't seen you since Super Mario Sunshine, Mr. Petey Piranha, sir. Uh, now, in this scene, you can only free one of the princesses, but it's very smart to save Zelda, because then you get both Zelda and Sheik, so why would you save Peach? Unless you're good with Peach, I guess, but I don't know. I, I have a buddy of mine in Smash. Is Smash 4 who's really good with Peach, but I mean, I, I got a buddy of mine who's really good with Zelda in Smash 4 also, but even in here, Zelda and Sheik are better than taking Peach off, so I'm gonna save, uh, Zelda. Whoa! Wario! With the subspace gun! Uh oh. I always thought this was the creepiest thing in the world. I'm like, oh my god, he's got a gun that turns him back at the trophies. Oh, man. Oh, the feels. No, Peach. <laughs> She's gone. <laughs> Let's go get her. Well, shit, five seconds. One second. Kirby, do something! Oh, you and your warp star curbs, you are, you are awesome. Take a Zelda with you. You a, you a pimp, Kirby. You got that girl. All right. Got myself a fairy from the Legend of Zelda: Twilight Princess and Donkey Kong Jr. Okay. Back to the map. Go to Sky World. Oh, and Pit sees the bad shit that's going down. Ooh -hoo. Well, what happened to my favorite game show? Ah, Palutina. You're in Smash Brothers now. You weren't before, but now you are. Here, I grant you my bow. So that you are now not some loser who can't fly without my help. Palutina is actually really good in Smash 4. It's got a lot of multi hitters. I have a better buddy of mine who mains Palutina too. <laughs> He's like, yeah, I got it. I'm so happy. I have the bow. It's what I've always wanted in life. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. I always thought it was so cool. Alright, then we are flying. Here we go. I'm alright with Pit. I don't like Pit so much in Brawl now. He's so much better at 4. His moveset is so fucked up in this game. It makes no sense. Especially his side beat. His side beat is so bizarre. Not to mention incredibly annoying. Okay. So these things give me items. Yo, stickers. Stickers are important. Even though I play in this emulated, I I mean I have a copy of Brawl already, but I've totally unlocked everything that could ever be unlocked. Oh, a trophy. I think that was a Metroid trophy. Let's go through the big door. Wow, that was that was so necessary to go through all that. You could have just skipped from that first cutscene to this cutscene. Oh beer. It's the Halberd. Meta Knight's totally kick-ass spaceship. They picked a really good ship to get possessed by the evil in this game, the, the Agent Minister's Army. It's, I mean, it's, it's one of the most iconic ships in Nintendo. It's really awesome. Alright, let's kill some more Heartless here. I think the bow could pass as a Keyblade for now. Let's do this shit. Bring it on, guys! Oh, boom. oh crap! Whoa, whoa! You got your little rapid punches there, don't you? Yo, give me ten seconds to fucking hit you! Gotcha! Super spicy curry. Let's get that. Shit. And uh, screw attack jump. Oh my god! This light jump is so weird. Bonk, later. Smart bomb trophy. Bonk, bonk. Later to all of y'all. 
fucks you up. Motion sensor bomb. Come here, bitch. Come on, approach me. Approach me, you motherfucker. <laughs> you're so stupid, and you're stupid. You guys gotta chill from below or above, but that's okay. Chocolate and food is very tasty. Wow, you're slow. Oh shit, hello. What are you? The Creeper. It's the Great Creeper. The Grim Creeper. Gotcha. It's a little too easy. Maybe I could turn up the difficulty a little bit. Maybe I could change that somehow. I don't know. I might change it to hard or something. Couldn't be too bad. It's Mario! You're asking flying out of the sky because Petey Piranha shot you with a cannonball somehow. Yo, I sense that uh, something, some bad shit is going down out here. We should work together for now. Because, you know, I can fly and you can jump super freaking high. I really prefer Mario over Ben, so. I'm gonna stick with the man. Hello. I'm just gonna fall and ignore all of you. Cause there's no reason to kill all of you. Alright. So now we're on here. I'm just gonna practice some karate. Whoa, well, these things I cannot kill. Ow. Oh, that's all of that. But yeah, that's annoying that you can't kill these things. I almost kill myself for whatever stupid reason. I was gonna fuck around with uh, those stupid little things down there. Those things are really annoying to kill anyway. The, I think they're called Griers if I remember this game. Oh my god, it's so cool when I combine a combine kill. Ah, oh, I missed the door. But it's so cool if I combine kill and like slam other bad guys into other bad guys. I just I love that effect because it, it kills them off. Oh, let's get this. A Lackitude trophy. Oh, the screen's moving up. I think there's another special on trophy up here. Boing, 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 boing. Back to flips. Mario is so agile. Boom, 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 boom. So graceful and fucking majestic. Give me my item. Ah, oh, it's a, it's a moblin from uh, Zelda. I love Zelda. I really do. Just love Zelda. It's such an amazing. Game. It's so good, you have no idea how good of a game it is. Whoa! That body you fell down because you're stupid. If only killing people in competitive was this easy. Oh, come on, bitches. Kick it all your asses. Kick it all your asses. Kick it all your asses. Eat that. Oh, it, oh, I gotta say, it didn't detonate. It's sometimes a dud. Wait a bitch. Oh, whoa, hello. Raw turrets! Boom. Oh, hamburger. And apples! I gotta love me some hamburgers and apples. Oh, took stuck the landing. 10 out of 10. Well, we missed the halberd. But wait! Here comes Fox in his R wing! He is so going out the halberd. Alright, well, I got me some shit. You come up the Mario and pit, yo. But, uh, I'm gonna have to save it here and stop for now because this game is so freaking cool. I love this game. Why am I talking like that? Now? But, anyways, this game has been really, really fun. I, I've always loved playing this game. I've never gotten tired of playing this story mode over and over. So, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button to leave a comment about those I should play in the future. And I will see you guys next time. Later!